1991, Down defeated Meath to win the All-Ireland Senior Football Championship. The 104th All-Ireland Football Final is underway. Kane firing it forward towards James McCartan. Can he be a match winner yet? On to Ross Carr, a quick look up on sport. But here we are almost 30 years later, and we're going to find out not just who is the toughest anymore, but perhaps who's the most resilient and who's the healthiest. Everyone always says, oh yeah, fit as a fiddle, um, super fit. Rambo, <laughs> fucking Rambo. <laughs> a bit of a shock result. He's come in over 1,200, Ivor. Oh, 1,200, that's a big score. No one has ever tested asymptomatic, healthy, retired, elite sportsmen for heart disease. They're firing well right now, Meath. Another scoring chance. Outside it comes to Bernard Flynn. Oh, it's not for Flynn. Secure in his holding. It's touched down again to David Beggy. A real business like approach now from Meath, frantically pouring everything they have into attack. Of course, there's no ball this time, and the CT scanner is now the scoreboard. We will scan the players for heart disease, and the winning team will be the one with the lowest average calcium score. Even my arteries were that of an 86 year old. What the hell is going on here? They have advanced heart disease? Why are we not looking for that? If we use this scan widely for middle risk people and we identified the truly high risk versus low risk, we could treat the high risk. I'm Dr. Tierney. I'm going to be uh, assessing some of the data today mm -hmm. and just to see that. Uh, the down team of 91. Um, hello, Mr. <laughs> How you doing? <laughs> if You're you thought, always good for a laugh, man. If, if, you, if you thought I was assessing your data, oh, no. I'd give you a heart attack. I would be very worried. <laughs> I think the evidence is overwhelming <laughs> that coronary calcium scoring is the most predictive test for prognostic risk. So if you want to know what your risk is for heart disease, have a coronary calcium score.